Karibu sana wapekuzi. On Sunday, 13th March 2022, there was a football tournament happening at Mahiga Primary School in Kahawa West in honor of sportman legend Alex Kariuki, who fell a victim of police extrajudicial killing on the morning of 9th March together with two others. Kari's coaches, or Kochare as many would call him, has been very impactful on matters football in Kahawa West and its environment. He was also an FKF official. We did this video as a tribute to the great man who has left a huge gap in the sports industry in this area. We also talked to a few people who knew him personally, or rather whose lives were impacted in one way or the other by Kochari. This is how the big day went down. Sasa. Kwa sana. Sat kuite nani? Naz. Naz jina yako ni jina yako yani Nancy Wamboi. Nancy Wamboi. Ah uh, sana Nancy. Leo tumekuja hapa shughuli ya Karis, Alex Kariuki, aka Coaches. Ah uh, ulikuwa unamjua as a person, ulikuwa unamjua wewe? Karis alikuwa best yangu. Ah uh, ni mse nimejua nikiwa Raima nikiwa Seko yani ni mse tumeguru na yeye mtaa moja and away from that amekuwa best like kule unaweza sema ni arifa yako eh so unamjua najua Karis at a personal level alikuwa best yangu sana eh. so naweza kuuliza Karis kwa wale wasi maybe wamjui wewe kuna mwana alikuwa alikuwa ni kama mse wa aina gani yani yani character yake ilikuwa yani what kind of person was he Karis was a peace lover alikuwa mse rosafi yani mm-hmm. alikuwa kiongozi mm-hmm. alikuwa mse anachukia uharifu uhalifu sana okay. yeah. mm-hmm. alikuwa ni mse yani mse wa kujituma mm-hmm. he was one of the people mwenye akiona ukifanya kitu mbaya na yeye ni best yake atakuwa ame unachoma unanichomea mm-hmm. so he was that kind of a person he was alikuwa ni ule mse yani a go to person eh karis alikuwa tu mse rosafi mm-hmm. in and out So kuna history inasemekana ati uh, Karisa alikuwa gasjua ati kuna zile story negative ziko kwa social media ati Karisa maybe alikuwa kwa hiyo story kkk wewe na haja wewe za pass wewe kama mimi kama naz mimi vile na joko chare kocha kwa akwa mse wa menendo mbaya atola 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 ni mse yani unaweza kai hivi na useme coach hakuwa mse wa menendo yenye ifurahishi imfurahishi na ifurahishi community during the first place alikuwa na recruit machali wache vitu mbaya watu wa dogo ukijua mtu yuko anakusumbua hata kama mama umpeleke kwa coach coach alikuwa ni yule mse ana reform watu hii na that is why he had an academy so hizi story zote mimi nasikia za coach zinanishtua sana saiju he was not that type of a person he was not karis ni yule mse yani mtu zingine unaona ni kuonewa na mimi ningesema kama mse anajua anaandika kitu kaiyo social media usiandike na sudo account kuja kama wewe wewe kama mse unajua ati unasema ulibiwa ama unajua mtu alibiwa na kochare kuja kwa police station enda kwa polisi andikisha OB na usilete saa hii ati vile amepass juu inaweza kwa fabricated jumse alibiwa back then ni mse najua uko obviously uli report mahali umeibiwa kuja na hiyo report tuonyeshe kwa sababu huu ni mse hatujaisikia hatujaisikia ni yani ni ule mse alikuwa na fight anything negative with all his might that was him uh, so saa hii wewe wewe kama Nancy Unazambia nini? Yaani mavijana huko kwa street ni nini? What advice unaweza wapatia? Mimi advice naezambia mavijana ju sisi wote ni wa young. Sisi wote ni vijana, sisi wote ni viongozi wa kesho. Okay. Sisi wote ni mabeste wa Karis. Mm-hmm. Kenya naweza waambia ni legacy Karis alikuwa nao na Kenya alikuwa na stand for mm-hmm. peace, love and unity na sports. Yaani wase wapige tizi kabisa, wase wako wase wazuri, yani reform manze. Na najua wase wote walikuwa na Karis na juu kuna hata under 13 kuna watu wadogo pia. Mm-hmm. Kenya naweza ambia watu ni vile Karis alikuwa tuige mwigo yake. Let us be the Karis of today. Ivo tu. Sana sana. Sana sana. Oa, uto nani? Asaf. Asaf, Asaf nani? Gakinya. Lakini eh sasa safi we coach Karis unamjuaje alikuwa anga coach mzuri ah alikuwa coach wako wewe ah mm. lakini alikuwa anga mzuri ah zii nakuuliza unamjua personal unamjua eh mm. alikuwa anga huko 
Yeah. Mm. Ama coach. Eh. Yeah. Eh. Yeah. Eh. Yeah. So, vile unamjua anaka alikuwa ni msaina gani yani? Nzuri. Mm. Eh. Kind alikuwa anga kind. Mm. Eh. Eh. Yeah. Alafu timu yako inaitwaje? Eh? Wacha za timu inaitwaje? Senya alikuwa anga? Azi sai sai wacha timu gani? Mimi, kawa sportive. Eh, kawa sportive. Eh. Hiyo ni nini yake ama ni ni organization yake ama form ni gani? Hapo mimi sijui. Eh. Eh. Wewe je tuko chikaris ni mzito. Eh. Eh. Sawa asante. Eh. Eh, ni aje ni aje. Poa sana bro. Ah, sawa unaitwaaje? Mimi naitwa Anko ama the talent doctor. Eh. eh. Na huko ndo mtaa. Eh, eh bana. Ah, sana kuuliza eh. Ah, uh, uh, hapa tumekuja shughuli ya Karis, Karis the coaches. Ola mjuaje Karis. Eh coaches nilimjua gatukiwa wadogo. Uh-huh. Tulikuwa wacheze anga team ilikuwa inaitwa Kongo FC. Uh-huh. Alikuwa gagola hiyo time. Na mimi nilikuwa gastopa wake. So ni mzee nimejua kutoka kitambo. After atoke Kongo, akaenda chuo ya coaching, akasoma coaching, akaanzisha ma academy, akaanza kufunza ma coach wengine. Sasa kama wale ma coach wote wako hapa kwa Igrao, yeye ndo aliwa train, yeye ndo amewanacha, yeye ndo amewapea platform na kila kitu. Eh, yeah. yeah. good. Alafu character yake ilikuwa gani? Alikuwa gani msaina gani yani? Coaches alikuwa msaina gani? Eh, coaches kitu ya kwanza naweza sema alikuwa amependa sport na alikuwa na discipline sana. Ni mse alikuwa anapenda kucheza sana, but alikuwa tu mse jovial, ni mse eh, akitoka zoezi, pia si mtu kujifunga, pia ni mtu sherehe kidogo. So tungepata naye kwa crowd ama tupata naye area anapiga sherehe. So Karis alikuwa gani mtu all round zisema, but discipline wise coaches alikuwa tick top notch. Eh. Ah sa hizo ndio zimekana ati Karis ilikuwa hivi ilikuwa hivi. Kuna chances alikuwa ama form ni gani? Mimi vile najua coaches na vile namjua. Coaches hajaikuwa muizi na coaches si muizi. Hata wale wali mada najua wanajua coaches hakuwa muizi. Fine inaweza kuwa labda alikuwa in the wrong company maybe but coaches coaches hakuwa muizi. Sema labda alipatikana on the wrong place labda at the wrong time. Unaona labda hiyo ilikuwa tu siku ya swara but si vile tunajua coaches coaches ni mse coaches ni mse discipline coaches si muizi na coaches hata ukiuliza ase wote nani ya shaibia nani nani ya shaibia na coaches hakuna mtu anajitokeza so wale wanaosema facebook alikuwa muizi wengi ni maswido account wanajaribu kukava rap ngori yake eh asante shukran sana fit fit wazi bro ni aje ni aje boss fit fit na kuitaje Alex Omgonda njani eh. ama umu. Eh. Eh. Na saa Alex nikuulize leo tumekuja hapa shughuli ya the man anaitwa Alex Kariuki pia ni mseko wako eh. Alex Kariuki ndishu. Eh. Uh, sijui kama ulikuwa unamjua. Karis amekuwa kochi wangu tangu totoni. Mm-hmm. Hiyo ni kuanzia under 10 na under 13 huko. Okay. So tumeokuna yeye hii jani ya football. Mm-hmm. Eh. Mm. So mimi namjua kama kochi wangu. Uh-huh. Eh yeah. ah, nice. So Karisa alikuwa gani personality personality yake ilikuwa gani kani msoi na gani hivi? Alikuwa gani what kind of person was he? Alikuwa yani ni msoi na gani hivi? Karisa ni mtu mtu alikuwa amejituma kwa futa. Okay. Na so kitu yake ilikuwa tu ni build talent. Hiyo mm-hmm. ndio ilikuwa furaha yake. Mm-hmm. A coach, mchezaji mm-hmm. akuwe to his best. Hivyo mm-hmm. ndio mimi namjua. Ah, perfect. Alasa kuna hizi stories zetu kwa mtandao ati sijui Karis kuna vitu negative zinaenea kwa mtandao juu yake. Wewe yeah. unaweza semaje kuhusu hizo stuff zinaenea? Kitu mimi naweza sema mimi naongea pande positive mm-hmm. kulingana vile tume grow. Mm-hmm. So mtu anaongea kuhusu negativity yake mm-hmm. ajitokeze mm-hmm. na pia na evidence mm-hmm. itakuwa shughuli poa sisi wote mm-hmm. tukijua negativity yake iko aje. Juu sasa si watu tunajua positive yake mm-hmm. tumepeana mm-hmm. uwa negative ajitokeze mm-hmm. aseme kulingana na yeye. Mm-hmm. Eh. Ah, perfect. Alafu sasa we advice yako kwa mayuto wa mtaa unaweza Mayuto huko mtaano umetulia. Mbebuche mm-hmm. za ball nini? Advice yako kwa unaweza ambia nini? Kwa mayuto ni bidi tu mtu ajikaze kwa ile shughuli anafanya mm-hmm. kama ni positive. Mm-hmm. Na kama ni negative mm-hmm. rekebisha mm-hmm. seek help fanya shughuli positive. Mm-hmm. Life ita songa. Shukran sa. Fiti fiti. Meshkuru. Start recording. Asasa. Poa. Abari yake. Poa. Fiti. Asasa, leo tumekuja huko nje ya mzee mzito marehemu Alex Kariuki. Sasa umekamuka nani kwanza? 
amekuja kama coach then ever since 2011 alinletanga grau akanyingiza kwa activities za maisa nikapata training ya coaching ya referee nimeenda tzd tu yake nimefanya nimefanya course mingi za coaching through yeye yeah, na my life skills ah perfect alafu naweza kuuliza nimesahau kuuliza jiro ito nani jerry jerry nani Lilian Jerry. Lilian Jerry. Sal Lilian Jerry. What do you Alex Karimuki as a person? I'm too a person. 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 I'm too Fanya coaching, you never know what to do. So, I'm going to go to the house. 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 What kind of person was he? Alikuwa, yani, character he? Alikuwa character? Alikuwa he? How did he? How did he? How did he? How did Nice. So hizo stories unasikia kwa mtandao, juu kuna ma stories kwa negative, juu yake kwa mtandao. Hizo story ni hekaya, ni yani ni story ya ziu kwa that zama. Oh eh, yeah. hizo story ya ziko. Sizo ni studio account. Mm -hmm. Ukiangalia nani anaongea ukiangalia, unaona mm -hmm. msata aje kwa FB. Mm -hmm. So for me najua ni uongo. Mm -hmm. Ah nice. Na kwa ribia mtu, wacha kwa ribia mtu jina. Ah, nice. Na kutuwe zata kuambia mavijana, wanya kwa mtaani, wame tulia tu hivu, wame zata kuambia nini? Neza wambia take care, be safe. Na juwa vijana uko inje, hakuna kazi. Tafadhalini, mtuwa sichagwe job. Hustle ni hustle. Boro rudishe unga, boro pate unga kwa nyumba. Ama uneza sema nini? For me, nambia tufanye ni kazi hote. Ah, sana, 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 nilia. Swafi. Mboka ni mboka. Hey, abari yako? Kwa sana? Sana kuitaje ndugu yangu. Mimi naitwa Kamuna. Ah, Kamuna. Saa Kamuna leo tumekuja hapa shughuli ya coaches Karis, Alex Karioki, alituacha the other day. Ah, uh, unamjua wewe eh, personal namjua? Kabisa Karis namjua tangu kitambo. First nilimjua wakati nili, niliamua nitasimama 2017. Okay. Wewe sikuwa namjua there before. Okay. So wakati niliamua nitasimama 2017. Okay. Eh, nili, niliona kuna potential ya kuda hapa mahiga mali alikuwa na anafunza kama coach kwa okay. ziye ni mtu ambaye ameshikilia ma youth okay. na ma youth wengi yeah. so niliona potential hapo na nikaanza kumtembelea from there mm -hmm. tukaanza kukutana kutana ma meeting nini nini kupanga mamba ya siyasa na haka ni support alini support sana yeah. though he never made it in 2017 yeah. mbaka saa hii 2022 20, bado tulikuanga tunapatana na ye mikutano mikutano ya ma youth sababu ya kutafuta kura so tani mechanga kuskia kariza mekuja ikakuwa venye imekuwa so nikitu imetu huzunisha sana kama wakaji wa kawest so ni aspirant mi ni aspirant hapa kawest okay. yeah. so we kamuna wewe kama kamuna umtu na mjua aje yani karakter yaki likuanga ni, ni mtu ina gani yani karakter yaki yani ni mse yani tabi yaki ni gani yani? karakter ya karis ni positive ana, ana tabi ya mbaya ujua iskia meshiku wat ya kwa police station okay. ujua iskia kwa na makashwa na watu okay. Ya yeah, tuni mtu ako straight mm -hmm. eh, na ndiyo tunashangaa what really happened what really happened hiyo ndiyo swali kila mtu hapa kwa Avesta kwa nayo mm -hmm. uh, kama hao wengine wawili waliuliwa wakiwa tatu hao mm wawili -hmm. watu wajui sana but Karis watu wanamjua mm -hmm. na watu wanasema wangependa justice kwa Karis sababu huyu ndiye watu wana, wanatambua na wanajua karakter yake okay. so si kuelewa ama ni mistaken identity mm -hmm. ama ni ile tu unaweza kuwa unatembea na mabeshte wenye ni waalifu pia wewe unagongewa hapo sasa ieleweki mm -hmm. yeah so kitu ya mwisho unaweza takwambia wakazi wa Kawest nini wakazi wa Kawest mimi naweza kuambia tu tutulie mm -hmm. sababu sasa Karis na hao wengine wawili washaondoka mm -hmm. kama ni sisi ma youth tuko na tabia zenye hazifai kwa society mm -hmm. tuweze kuchange hizo tabia mm -hmm. tuweze kushika ma youth wetu kama sisi viongozi mm -hmm ili tuwape makazi ama skills mm -hmm. zenye zinaweza fanya hawa ma youth wa, waache hizo tabia zenye wako na sababu wanafanyanga hizo tabia sababu maybe ya wana pesa kwa mfuko mm -hmm. but the moment ume, ume, umepea hawa ma youth skills kesho watakuwa na nafasi ya kuandikuwa ama kuajiriwa kazi mm -hmm. na waendelea na maisha yao kama kawaida kama wale watu wengine yeah. okay.
Okay, so asante sana.